what's your name? Chantel. Chantel, how are you doing? Are you enjoying yourself? I am, yeah. Excellent. What brought you here today? Basically, I've been away for the past year and I've been really psyched to get involved in the Yes campaign okay. and show that I'm voting and supporting. Excellent. Have you seen any no campaign around here today? I have actually, yeah. Uh, uh, the Caribbean Sun's along there. Uh-huh. Um, so, like, that's about it. But I haven't seen anything bad. No, no, that's what I was asking. But what do you think about this? I mean, as far as I can tell, these aren't just Yes campaigners. This is a sort of grassroots it public. Is grassroots. It's a public mood, yeah. It is, definitely. And when people are sick, I mean, like, they're sick of the complacency of Westminster. The status quo is not good enough. Guys, are we going to win? I hope so. I seriously hope so. I'll be disappointed if we don't. Okay, Chantel, thanks very much for talking to us, okay? Bye bye. Sir. What's your name? Andrew. Andrew. Your name? Ross. Ross and, Ross and Andrew, you're on Independence Live. How are you doing? <laughs> hey, how are you feeling? Uh, very good. Are you enjoying this? Absolutely brilliant. Everyone's in such high spirits. So yeah, excellent. Have you seen any no people around? A couple. Just a couple? Yeah. Two of them? Two of them. How many people are here? I'd say about 2,000. Okay, and would you call us? Up, up, up and down the country. Would, would you say this is an indication that we're doing a little bit better than they are? Aye. Yeah. So the popular mood. Hi. Sir, what's your name? Tom. Tom, it's nice to meet you, Tom. I How are you feeling? Be, I got the great news. Uh-huh. And the thing is, I see independence and self-determination as a white woman in Scotland. Uh-huh. I don't see us as the working classes in England. Good. I see us showing them the way. Uh-huh. And there's a better way. And the best way for Scotland is independence. So if we can prove that the working classes can take control of the labour force and we can work things out better than that. Like London, because the Parliament don't run the country. The city of London runs this country. And it's big money that talks. And that's the wrong scare campaign company. I've been doing an unscientific poll doing a bit of speech where I live. And I've been asking people how they vote. And it didn't really match the poll. The mood in the country is yes. So join us now, vote yes. And let's take this country forward to make it what we want to make it. Excellent. Thanks very much. Thank you. Hello, madam, how are you doing? What's your name? <laughs> Guys, hello. Independence Live. I don't know what's wrong with these people. How are you doing? What's your name? Amanda. Amanda, how are you doing? You're on Independence Live. Oh, hello. How are you feeling? Hi, good. Nice. Great day. Okay. Uh, what do you think's happening here? I mean, I know it's an organised sort of gathering, but what do you think's really happening behind? I think this is the people having a voice. Uh huh. I think um, the last few days has been really overtaken by Project Fear. Uh huh. And I felt a lot of people have really felt they've had to come out today just to show that we're, this is about the people, by the people, for the people. Uh huh. So. Do you think there's been a, a backlash? By by the, the public against the rubbish they've had in the last few days, RBS, well, etc. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. That's why I think so many people have, have came out today uh. because Project Fear is, is, is trying to do that, it's trying uh. to frighten us into not having our own control of our own country. Yeah. And I think the people just aren't having it in Scotland. This isn't all just campaigners, is it? This is. Oh, no, absolutely not. And I was here a couple of weeks ago with the Radical Independence, and I will say that today there is a bigger diversity of people definitely here. Uh. So there's young and old, and I think the debate during the week with the 67. There are many, many more of them on the street here today, oh. and I think it's galvanised. You know, it's 93.5% of the population has registered to vote, yeah. and they haven't registered to vote to keep the status quo. That's very true, yeah. So, so I mean, this is, what, this is what we're doing here today. It's, it's, it's showing everybody that, you know, we want to be 
that is down my project here. So all, all indications are good? I think so. I think we'll be doing it again just later on this week. Excellent. Thanks very much for talking no to us, okay? okay. Hi sir, what's your name? My name's Paul. Paul, how are you doing? Not bad. This isn't a setup, is it? No. No. You're not a plant, are you? No. Okay, how are you feeling about this? Oh, I'm feeling very uh, excited. Aye, it's going to happen. Excellent, okay. Just having a wee look around, were you expecting to see this when you came out the underground? Well, I heard about it, it was happening, but you don't normally see this every, every day if it's underground. Oh. It's definitely a popular mood, isn't it? So oh, it definitely is. It's, it's getting stronger and stronger. It's like it's cool. It's very cool. I mean, oh, I'm going to be sad when it's over. Well, I tell you what, there's phase two and there's phase three. You know, we've got various other stages to take our nation forward. So, oh, yeah. still a lot of work to be done. But we'll look back with this. Fond memories of this. Aye. Uh, plenty of photos and videos anyway. Okay, well, I'll tell you what, we'll maybe film for a, a couple more minutes, get a couple other people's opinions. So, okay, no, welcome no, along with us. No. Right. Badges, free badges. Independence Live. What's your name? Hi, Davey. Davey, it's nice to meet you, Davey. Are you a campaigner? No. Are you uh, just an ordinary just member of the public? Yeah. That's brilliant. I was trying to get somebody who's just an ordinary member of the public. So, yeah. what's brought you along here today? Uh, just the vibes, a brilliant atmosphere, show support, show that people are undecided or possible no voters. There's another way to vote and we can have independence for ourselves. We right. ourselves, change the future. You feel there's, a, there's a, something in here about this? It's a bright, bright, you can see people dancing, everybody's enjoying themselves. It's not like, no clashes, no, no problems at all. It's a brilliant atmosphere. Have you seen any no supporters? Very few, uh -huh. very few, they seem to be um, keeping their distance. Aye, okay, okay. They've probably got a wee special common off spot for themselves with mainstream media cameras or something like that. Probably, yeah, they'll be tied by the politicians to do all the work for them and big businesses to speak out on behalf. Excellent. Any predictions for next week? Um, I think it's going to be close, but I'm going to remain optimistic and I think it could surprise them. Excellent, Dave. Thanks very much for talking to us. Good luck, big man. How you doing, mate? Hey, you're good, back mate. on Independence Live, man. Hey, how you doing, man? How you doing? Right, you Matt, you know your video's got like over a quarter of a million hits on it already. So I hear, man. So I Brilliant, man. You have single handedly won the referendum. Hey. Is that fair to say? I thought it was Rupert Mugdog. I thought he liked to be a uh, kingmaker, man. I didn't think it was a dafty. Uh, well, everybody. The gravy stains that makes the referendum, <laughs> you know what I mean, man? Everybody's trying to claim the same crown. Hey. Danny, how you doing, mate? <laughs> Independence Live once again. See what you did yesterday. Absolute gold. Political gold. That's, it's gone all around the world, man. This morning it was 290,000 or something on YouTube. Unbelievable, man. How do you feel about it? What you've done? I feel overwhelmed. Like, uh, I think it's amazing. It shows like what people power can do. Because it was the like. It was some, somebody came up, somebody heard the information they were coming, they phoned somebody else who got the, the idea, oh. who phoned somebody else to speak to, who phoned somebody else to phone Matt, who then phoned me, I had to phone somebody else to get the relationship. So all of us coming together is what made that happen. Oh. And we beat the media machine. Yes, yes that's indeed. What, that's, what, that's what matters, you know, these guys have got yep. all their interviews for their fancy cameras, yep. and it's all got da da Yes da, indeed, da, 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 in the background, so they can't even use them. Well, Most weird. of what was shown was their reaction to what you were doing. <laughs> you know? That's brilliant. So fantastic. Well done, man. Thanks. Uh, okay, so what do you feel about what's happening here today? Well, there's a lot more yes people here today uh, than no people there were the other day. Okay, I mean, it's not all campaigners, is it? Nah, it's a here. It's like, it's the people who have just come along. It's the last weekend before the vote. Yep. It's people who made up their mind and thought, fuck okay, uh -huh. let's come out and see what's happening. Are you getting the same kind of vibe for the no side? I think the no side, like, there's a bit more, they're a bit more reserved. I think they, they, they're feeling that maybe they're, they're less likely to win this. this Have they lost the public mood? Sorry? Have they lost the public mood? 
Well, I think, yeah, I, I think definitely the no campaign, certainly. I don't, I wouldn't, I don't want to say about people avoid no, because I think a lot of people avoid no, and, you know, I've got just, you know, they've, they've, they've maybe yeah. been doing some for, for many years. In terms reasons. of the campaign, yeah. But in terms of the no campaign, they've lost it, like, nobody's, nobody's paying any attention to it. And a lot of people who were undecided have been won over, not by the yes campaign, but they've been, they've been pushed away by the no campaign. Yeah, okay. Um, so, Actually, yeah. so... I'm just going to take. I'm going to take this camera and just give a one last sort of swivel around, just to let people at home see what's happening. Okay. But thanks very much for talking to us. Okay. No worries. We'll speak to you again for late Cheers. after the after Thursday. I say it'll be a big party here on Friday, all over, everywhere in Scotland. Toasting a new future. Okay, guys. There you go. Sun is shining. Look at this. Look at this.